girls good morning i'm so happy because you guys loved the last day in my week in my life and i just am excited about it because i was truly just being myself and i feel like that's what always comes across best with when i'm just genuinely sharing my life the focus is me being the best version of myself and i like to show you that in a whole week because you get the whole picture so we're gonna do another week in my life of a girl striving to be the best version of herself. It's a lot of effort, it's a lot of conscious energy, but for me it's so worth it and it's so rewarding. So let's jump right into it. I'm on my way to a bunch of work meetings. I want to show you what I'm wearing. So we have a blazer, which I like it better without the blazer. I don't know why, I just feel better without it, but in case it gets cold in there, I can put the blazer over my shoulders or on. I'm wearing this Kate top. These are just Levi, Levi jeans. Um, 501, they're like the traditional old school jeans, but to make it a little bit more dressed up or like styled, I rolled them down. Also, cause when I put this top, these pants like this, I feel like it, I lost shape in my waist. So one of the biggest things is learning to dress I've had to learn with fashion is dressing for my body type. I have, like everyone, we have things we like to showcase off more and other things we don't that aren't flattering so much for our body shape. So for me, I finally learned to love to love the shape of my arms and I view it as one of my unique parts of my body. And I feel like the most unique things of our body are what makes us the most beautiful. So. I'm embracing it and I now love to show them off and I feel like this cut is also just very flattering. I'm wearing my pasta bag. This is from Bottega Veneta. And I'm wearing oh, these he heels that are also Bottega Veneta. They're a square toe, which I feel like adds like a little bit of style to it as well. So we're starting the day. I have meeting, like I told you, I'm drinking some glowing greens for the energy, for the focus, whenever I feel like I need an extra boost, I have glowing greens. If it's before a workout, before an important meeting, there's 30 fruits and vegetables and so much fiber and digestive enzymes, so. Mm. In addition to the home that we got this week was this blessed candle. It came from a church in Colombia. So we light it every Sunday for a few minutes. Well, we haven't yet, but this Sunday will be our first time lighting it for five minutes. I think it's gorgeous. And then I rearranged my coffee table. I'm back for my meetings. I'm gonna film a little content now. I'm doing a protein cookie recipe. I'm gonna put the whole recipe in a separate video, but you can get a little BTS of like the content creator side of how I do this. I'm filming on Instagram, on my phone for Instagram, TikTok, and YouTube shorts. And then I'm filming YouTube and, and <laughs> And then on this camera, I'm filming my vlog and the recipe video. So I'm filming three different things and I have to give each camera what they need. So it's a lot of multitasking. So let's start with the recipe video. Girls, these protein cookies are my favorite when I need a sweet treat during the week, but I still want to maintain. Girls, let's make protein cookies together. Girls, let's make our cinnamon chocolate chip cookie too many words. Girls, let's make our cinnamon chocolate chip protein cookies together. I am a huge cookie lover. I have a cookie many times a week and I also have wellness goals of maintaining lean muscle. So these are my healthier, cleaner cookie option that are still amazing in taste. Like to me, they taste just as good as any other cookie recipe and I feel good after and it has great macros. So let's get into it. try these delicious protein cookies and our vanilla protein plus which will help make your favorite baking recipes a little bit more well balanced cleaner and feel really good on your wellness journey see you next time bye okay done with that we have to do this over here i actually need i actually need a picture photo aesthetic vibes always You. 
You girls have to try my favorite protein cookies. Now I'm filming an ad for Facebook. I have lots of wellness goals, but I also have a huge sweet tooth, which is why I love our vanilla protein plus, because you can bake with it. And your favorite recipes can now become more one. I can't eat more cookies, so that means we're done. Good morning, girls. It's super early, so I'm just gonna have some grapefruit for my workout. And then I'm bringing my post protein smoothie to have right when I finish. Well, we just finished our arm day. I'm having my post-workout protein smoothie, which is technically my breakfast. I used papaya today, which was really interesting, but so good. And also, you girls, if you're looking for full-length workout videos to follow, because you might not know what to do in the gym, or you just don't know what to do, I created a subscription option on Fit with Cambry's Instagram where I'm posting my full complete workout. So the arm day I did today, you girls can follow along with me. I did my leg day um, that I did the other day. So I'm posting a new video every week just to start off and you can follow along with all the workouts. So it's super convenient and easy and I'm just literally filming the exact workouts that I'm doing. So um, if you need some more support in the gym, that's there for you girls. What's in here is Fit with Cambry Vanilla Protein Plus, of course, for the 17 grams of protein, slow digesting, not bulky, easy on the gut, tastes amazing, frozen papaya, oats, almond butter, ice, and almond milk. So that's it. treatment I come every six weeks I decided to gift myself this for Christmas last year it's the gift that keeps on giving and I don't like having ingrown hairs and I get crazy ingrown hairs on my legs my bikini and so I just decided to commit to being very diligent about my laser appointments so summer's coming up and I started in December for my first appointment so we're almost halfway through and I do see huge improvements. To me, this is part of wellness, so I'm going to feel good in my bathing suit this summer. I'm not going to have to deal with irritated skin bikini lines that drive me crazy and actually scar me. So I'm very excited and yeah, I actually fell asleep during my treatment, so my face is a little puffy right now. I should have made my papaya chunks smaller. They're way too big. If there's a morning that I don't have good digestion, which I realized are the nights I don't take deep bloat pills, so if I forget to take deep bloat at night and I wake up in the morning with slow digestion, papaya and coffee just has everything moving like crazy. So I just had a big bowl of papaya. I'm gonna make a little coffee and then I'll have my normal breakfast. A little later, praying the rosary every morning has changed my mental and spiritual health. I used to wake up and I still struggle with it, but feeling like exhausted no matter how many hours I sleep. And it's just my body's way of almost shutting down and not wanting to face the day. But that's my biggest mental health struggle is waking up in the morning. So I pray this right when I wake up every single morning and it just starts my day, putting it in God's hands, trusting that whatever this day is gonna bring, I can get through it because I have God with me and I 
trust him. So I've let go a lot of trying to control everything and putting it more in God's hands and that's given me a lot of peace. This is my fresh milk I get from the farm every Saturday and I bring it in this little, I have no idea what you call this in English, it's Spanish it's called a porta leche, like a milk carrier. So I bring this fresh milk with me every week and I make my coffees with it and I bake with it and it's just unbelievable. Here's a cup of milk. I drink a cup of milk with my coffee. It has eight grams of protein, amazing probiotics and fats when it's unpasteurized like this. It does look different than store-bought milk, which took me a little time to adapt to because I'm like, it's yellow and like has like weird things going on in there. But that's nature for you. Wow, that is insanely good. The real milk just makes it so creamy. Ooh. So girls, um, I have to leave in one hour. So I'm gonna do some work on my phone post. I started that new workout subscription on Instagram. So I'm posting all of my workouts for you girls for you to follow along. So I'm gonna go and post one of the videos that I just filmed yesterday, the arm day, which my arms are very sore from. I'm gonna do some Q and A's on my story, respond to DMs, and then we'll head to our first appointment. So see you girls in a little bit. Girls, I'm making dinner now and I swear if you can learn an easy chicken recipe, cooking at home becomes so much easier. I always just have an issue with proteins. Like I didn't know how to cook a tasty chicken or steak. So this is my go-to chicken recipe. I can do it with the full baked chicken or the legs or the thighs. All you do is put a bit of thyme and garlic around the chicken and then you coat the chicken in salt, paprika, and olive oil. And that's it, and it's so good and super easy and delicious. I'm gonna put the timer on for 35 minutes and then I might flip the chicken over so the other side gets crispy. We're at 350. All about super easy and quick recipes. Like I don't ever let my lunch or dinner take more than 30 minutes to make because that's just not realistic for me. So all my recipes, they're in my ebooks too. If you girls need quick at home, easy recipes, you can use them in my ebooks. They're all so good and really easy. And I also a lot of times just work with what I have in my fridge at the time, but we always do a protein, a salad, and some sort of carb. Splash of white wine vinegar. <laughs> Oven baked recipes are the easiest, especially for proteins. Here's our dinner. I'm gonna also make a little bit of pasta, but that's gonna take some time, so. I'm not gonna take you guys through that process, but for our carbs, I'm gonna make a little pasta with olive oil and garlic salt, so good. But we're gonna start with this now because it's ready sooner.
just finished my core and cardio. It was challenging, but the thing with the workouts that I do is they're 30 minutes, so I'm in and out. Super effective, and I love the results that they give me. A few things about working out. I have a five rotation workout schedule, so let me explain. I have an upper day in the gym, a lower day in the gym, a core and cardio day in the gym, a class, and an outdoor activity. Now, I don't always get all five of those in a week, so I don't follow a week schedule. I don't know how to explain this. So say for this week I did an upper and lower. I was only able to get into the gym twice a week. Next week, I wouldn't start again here. I would start with the corn cardio and then go like this. So I just kind of always go like this and I don't have it set on a certain day of the week. But I try, ideally, my ideal scenario, which doesn't happen too often, is I do in a week upper, lower corn cardio, and then on the weekends, a class and an outdoor activity. But the minimum that I try to get in is two a week. So I hope that makes sense. And it's super sustainable for me. It's fun. It's My body's always trying new things, so I feel like I never plateau. And like I told you girls before, if you want workout help, you can subscribe on my Instagram for that. And please comment if you have any questions, if anything I said didn't make sense. These are yucca flatbreads. My first time trying them, but yucca is amazing for eyebrow growth. Also, girls, I need new pans. I I just can't. When I wipe a towel on here, black stuff comes off. Having fish today. I try to have fish at least twice a week. I'm gonna do olive oil. Squeeze of lemon. I don't love fish, so lemon to me is a great way to cover fishy taste. And canola and salt. And some rosemary. It'll just give it a little bit of flavor. I like it very lemony. That's it. We just put it in the oven. We have branzino, yucca with avocado. Mm -hmm. Girls, I just finished filming our girls chat, which was last week's YouTube video, and it went so well. We talked all about home, work life, how to live a wellness life in a nine to five. One of my favorite videos I've done yet. I just love sitting down and chatting with you girls. I feel like we can just get to know each other so much better. So I'm gonna do a little unboxing. I know the packaging is so strange, but just ignore that. I, oh, I'm so excited for this. I have a new girlfriend named Romy, and she came out with a workout line called Revive. Revive, and I see her wearing it all the time, so I asked her if I could try it because her cuts are super cute. So this next week, I'm gonna try these workout sets on. So cute. Look at, oh, this is my favorite cut. It's like short, very short. Love that. Let's see. Wow, she sent me so many cute ones. Revive. The material's super soft. And I love black and white. I love simple colors. Oh my gosh. Cr little V in the front. So flattering. I feel like her cuts are so flattering. A little scrunch in the booty. That makes the booty look like a peach. And then my friend who's a photographer named Clint, I don't know if you've seen him on Instagram or TikTok. Clint, he came out with a bikini line and he sent me his bikini. This is so cute, are you kidding me? Look at this, called Clint. Ooh, it's tiny, tiny. <laughs> but so cute, the fabric, are you kidding? Love that. Cannot wait to try that. This brand DL1961, I asked, I just, 
honestly spend my bored moments on the couch messaging brands for them to send me things. It's one of my favorite activities because it's like free online shopping and I'm so thankful that brands want to send me stuff. So this, I only choose things that I, I want. Like I don't, brands sometimes send random things. These are all things that I chose. This is insane. This is like a leather, full leather outfit. Super nice, nice quality. It's real leather. And it comes with matching pants. Oh my goodness gracious, I cannot wait to try this. It's like a deep brown. So that's such a cool set. Look at that. Okay, I cannot wait to wear that. And then, my other friend Roxy, I asked her to send me her stuff. Cute, it's called I Am. I Am, woo! That's Roxy. Ooh, cute. Hormone cheek drops. Put them on your cheeks. This is eye serum. Mm, so I guess they're skincare products with wellness benefits. Cute packaging. Roxy, way to go. Cute. It's an eye serum. Wow, smells amazing. Roxy, you killed it. Hyaluronic acid lip plumper. Okay, Roxy's winning. No, it's a quartz crystal. <gasps> it's a quartz crystal. As the roller, are you kidding? Roxy, you went above and beyond. Shashi. This is a brand called Shashi. Oh, which I, I messaged them to send me jewelry and I chose the ones that I. Oh my god. Gosh, gosh, sorry. Sorry, God. Oh my gosh. This is gorgeous. It's a little choker, gold with diamonds and little stones. This is stunning. This is gorgeous. More gorgeous in person. Comes with matching earrings. It's gorgeous. Wow, thank you so much. This is called Shashi. And the box, the box is so nice, you can feel the quality. Joshi? Joshi sent me another thing. I forget what I asked for. <gasps> I think earrings. I love earrings. Oh, cute. Little hoops. So cute. I wanted chunky little ones. You know, everyone has this big chunky earring trend going on right now. Like the big chunky, like, you know what I'm talking about. Like big squares or big. I'm not super into it. I don't know why to me it feels like I don't know, because I just feel like I'm wearing a costume. Like if I saw someone wearing it and then I go and try to find the exact same things, I feel like I'm just like imitating something and I always want to be true to myself. Cute. Oh, so cute, look. That is so cute. I love them. I'm gonna put them on right now. If you put on chunky earrings and you feel like you look so good and you feel confident, wear chunky earrings. It's okay to be inspired by trends, but don't just wear things because a trend says it and you feel uncomfortable in it. Okay, lastly, okay, I got this. I ordered this myself. Different, it's a acne clearing body scrub because after I work out, I get some acne on my back. So I'm excited to try this. And then my friend Lauren Perez, who's actually my sister's boyfriend's sister, sent me her Anna Blue hair products, which 
She has the most beautiful hair and she is also all about quality of ingredients and all of that. So she sent me this and her packaging too is gorgeous. It's like a matte blue and the products are also matte. This is a scalp cleanser. For me who have been on my hair growth journey, I did learn a lot about scalp health and that a lot of our hair issues actually come from our scalp. So I think that's what she was inspired. So I think this is gonna be amazing to use. She sent me a treatment oil and a hair serum. Let's open the hair serum and see how it smells. I'm also so impressed with their packaging. Okay, first impression. Whoa. Oh my gosh. Oh, it smells like a spa. Oh my goodness. It smells like a spa. I can't identify what it is. Orange. Wow, there is orange peel oil in here. It smells like a spa. Unbelievable, I cannot wait to try that. And I hope you girls loved this week's video. Please comment what you want next, DM me. All the links to our WhatsApp group chat, my website, our plans, our products, Instagram, it's all in the caption below. Subscribe if you like my channel, like the video, comment. It always means a lot to me and it helps my videos get more seen, which always helps to inspire more women. I'll see you next week for our weekly Sunday video. Love you girls so much. Have an amazing week and be inspired and be the best version of you. Then the